There's been a lot of research trying to uncover the psychological and neural mechanisms of moral judgments and moral decisions. And many of these studies have tried to understand the extent to which the processes involved in more moral judgments and behavior are more rational, deliberative, planned, goal-directed versus more automatic, impulsive, maybe emotional, reflexive. I think this is very complicated and I think it's not the right question to ask whether morality is reflective or reflexive, automatic or deliberative, but rather to try and understand in what contexts or maybe in what individuals are moral processes likely to be driven by these different mechanisms. And in my lab, we use computational models to try and better characterize how these processes unfold in the mind and the brain. And the computational approach, I think, is a really useful way to address this question because it forces you to specify very uh, concretely what is meant by deliberative or um, impulsive. Um, for example, there's a distinction in computer science between model-based algorithms and model-free algorithms, which use different procedures to learn the value of different actions. And various projects of, in my lab are looking at how well model-based and model-free algorithms can characterize moral judgments and moral decisions.